Unicube is Speedcube Shop's custom cube service where you can completely customize a cube to your liking. In this video, I bought a Unicube to just try it out and see how much I liked it because I've never bought any custom cubes before. If you want to get your own Unicube, then you can go to speedcubeshop.com and find them under the premium puzzle section. They have a lot of cubes you can choose from and you can customize your favorite one. If you like this video, subscribe and turn on the notifications so you know the next time that I upload content. So yeah, enjoy the video. Alright, um, I'm gonna get a custom Yuhu V2M because the Yuhu is a great Mega Minx and I just want to see like what a custom setup on the Yuhu would be like. So Unikeep Yuhu V2M, let's see, factory magnets, Unicube custom version. Alright, so I think this little box here is where I actually do the customizing. So there's a bunch of different tabs and I get to customize here. Okay, starting with the core lube and tensioning. I think a heavier lube is normally good for core lube. Vortex is meant to be for core, but it's expensive. <laughs> um, I don't know like how different lube speeds affect the core lube, so I'll just put weight six, I guess. It's a pretty neutral weight. I think it would work pretty well. Peace lube. Just from experience, I know the Yuhu has to be fast. If you set it up slow, it's gonna be really bad. So I'm going to be using Lunar and Martian because you can look over here, um, they're both really fast and I think that would definitely help with the performance. Okay, add-ons. These are very pretty add-ons but I really don't need them so I'll just skip that. Um, the logo sticker, the Unicube logo sticker looks much cooler than the default one or the classic one so I'm going to use this. And warranty, I don't need a warranty, but it's cool that they offer it. So yeah, that's it for the customization. I uh, just need to check this checkbox to agree to whatever they're saying and then add to cart. Nice. Okay, now I'm gonna show you guys a really cool trick that you can use to save money at SES. So what you wanna do is you wanna click on this box here and then you wanna type Java Cuber for an amazing discount. Oh yeah, look at that. Alright, so that's it. I'm just going to place the order now and come back to you guys once it's actually here. Bye. Alright, the cube arrived. I'm really excited to try it out. Um, what is this? Oh, so this is like the custom card order. It looks super cool. I'm gonna put this on my wall because I put everything on my wall. Okay, moving on to the cube now. Okay. We just have the cube and a little pamphlet thingy. So this is the cube. Um, feels a tiny bit greasy on the outside, but it's not that bad. And I'm pretty sure that'll go away pretty soon. Uh, you can see here the Unicube logo, they put that on. It is a square logo on like a circle. Which is kind of funny because it's meant to like be on a 3x3. Three three. Okay, going into first turns. Okay, this is really cool. It's really quiet, which I wasn't really expecting. Um, I don't think my other view is nearly this quiet. And yeah, the greasiness is kind of like annoying, so I'm going to quickly wipe that off. Okay, I wiped off some of the loot, but there's still quite a lot on the outside. But that's okay, I'll just deal with it for now. But yeah, the turning is really nice. Uh, the tensions seem even, which is good, because tensioning a mega is painful if you do it on your own. And like, overall, every single layer feels very consistent and exactly the same. It wasn't as, as fast as I thought it'd be, but it's not slow. It's definitely not slow. Um, the reason I'm like locking up on my turns is because like I keep slipping off because of all the lube on the outside. But once that goes away, I think my turning will become a lot better. Yeah, the cube feels very, very well set up, and I don't have any complaints about like the setup. It feels really good. Like, it's way better than what I could set it up myself. 
So yeah, once I get used to this cube a bit, I'll record some cells and put them at the end of this video if you want to watch that. But since this video is a bit short, I do have another unboxing from Speed Cube Shop. Okay, here's the second package. It's pretty big. Let's see what's in here. Oh yeah, this is the hoodie that I got. Wait, this actually came really quick. I wasn't expecting it to come this quick. So yeah, um, it's not really going to fit in the frame, but can see here this is what the logo looks like it's the distorted logo which is really cool if you look up closely it kind of has like that fringe of red and blue which i think looks pretty cool so yeah it's a really soft hoodie but like i can't really show it in this video because of how big it is compared to a cube now i'm going to do some solves in the yuhu so that you can see that it's like actually a very good cube and they set it up really well so yeah thanks for watching this video and goodbye Hey guys, after doing a couple solves in the Yuhu, it broke in and became much faster, which is definitely good as I can max out my TPS and do ALGs really fast. I wasn't really able to get good times during my sessions, but that was really only my fault and not the cube or the setups. I'm too used to the Dian Megaminx, which is way smaller and lighter, and it has a completely different turning style. I think if I spent a few days trying to get used to the Yuhu and adapting my turning to it, I could get some good times on it. Anyways, the Unicube setup is great. The cube is super quiet and has a very soft, plush feel. I really like turning it and just doing random algs, and it feels super smooth. The tensions are even, which makes turning the cube very enjoyable. My one complaint about the cube is that it came with a ton of lube on the outside, but that wasn't too much of a problem. I just wiped it off. I'm super impressed with how well Speedcube Shop set up the cube, and I wouldn't hesitate buying another one. I'd highly recommend buying any premium cube from them. The cube that they sent me is easily the best you have ever tried by far, so yeah. It's a very good cube, very impressive, and I'm happy that I got it. So thanks so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed, be sure to subscribe, and until next time, goodbye.